Yo, what's going on guys, your boy BLS here, and you're watching this on a Monday, and unfortunately, the BL3 beta is gone now. Bondi, what are we supposed to do now? What are we supposed to do now? I don't have an Xbox One, so I'm probably gonna see if I can borrow an Xbox One so I can get the beta, maybe, I don't know. About 10 minutes ago, I just got done watching Jeb's 1 million video. What? I'm gonna be honest, I cried a little bit during that video, started to tear up, I to... Get, get the tears out of my eyes real quick. Honestly, that was a really well put together video by Jeff. He did really well on that. And it was like one of those like sentimental things. Like he'll look back in like a couple years and he'll be like, damn, dude, that's a sick video. Threaten. Battery down. Overwatch down. Oh my god, these guys are getting absolute D. Battery KIA. UAV ready for deployment. I don't think I honestly don't think this is legal what I'm doing to these kids right now. There's gotta be some type of charge for this. What am I? 17 and 2? It's not legal. Overwatch down. Oh my gosh, finally. 21 and 3. Jeff put that video together so well that it honestly like it 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 there was two reasons why I cried during Jeff's video. Reason one is because I know he's worked really hard. It's hard to make videos every day and especially like them do as well his do as Overwatch his do. Down. But another one is another reason I cried is because I'm so fucking jealous, man. He gets he has like a crazy ass fan base. There's only like a couple people I know who have a better fan base than Jev. And they're not even Call of Duty YouTubers. So like Jev has one of the best Call of Duty like fan bases in my opinion. Like, when I liked the video, it had, like, 200-something thousand uh, views, but it had 80,000 likes on it. You don't see that very often with Call of Duty YouTubers. I'm going for a trick shot. Oh, my gosh! Bro, dude! I just hit a trick shot! I don't know where he was! What? I was like, oh, just go for a trick shot. This is, like, the second time I've ever trick shot. Please don't be a barrel stuff. OMG, please don't be a barrel stuff. Oh my god, she was right next to me. Oh, no, dude, I thought that was like way, 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 way back. Oh, I feel like a fucking failure now. Well, that was my first trick shot on BO3 on the last day that it's out. That's not usable. Like I was saying though, I'm extremely jealous of Jev because of the fan base he has. Like, if I was even half that, I'd be happy. A quarter of that, I'd be happy. A tenth of that, I'd be happy. Fuck, if I had 100,000 subscribers, I'd be a lot happier than I am now. But as far as BO3, guys, I feel like BO3 is going to be a good game for me because I actually have a chance. I'm actually decent at it. I won't be trick shotting in it, obviously, because I'm not a trick shotter. So, um, you know, I've hit like six or seven sniper clips that are pretty good. And I plan on doing a beta montage uh, soon, or I might just keep them for an episode. I don't know. So what I'm going to start doing a lot more in my videos is just telling stories and, like, I'm tired of tr pushing out stupid videos and all that. So what I'm going to do is, you guys, if you guys want to, oh my god, I'm still on the highest sensitivity. If you guys want to, like, put video suggestions for me to tell stories down in the comment section, I, I'll be more than happy to do those. If you guys have any suggestions, make sure you leave them down in the comments and leave a like on this video if you enjoyed. This is Moody Boy BLS. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.